Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, or for the very first time, to the Thoughts and Crep Show. Where today, as per usual, it's your host, Anjo, here with part 32 of Resident Evil HD, the PS4 version running on the PS5. Hope you guys are all doing well today. And, uh, yeah, on today's episode, we are rejoining Chris and Rebecca, and to a lesser extent, Rich here and um actually wait can i talk to him oh he's sleeping okay um he's sleepy he's a sleepy boy he's sleepy so sleepy um yeah in today's episode we are going to be Actually, yeah, yeah, I could keep the, uh, yeah, I'll just keep the handgun on me for now. Uh, we're going to be going to do the uh, first yawn fight and getting the final uh, death mask. That is the plan for now. And actually, come to think of it, I believe we need... Yeah, don't we need a new key? The uh, shield key? Oh, right, we do need that. So, we're also going to do the piano thing. Because I haven't grabbed the music sheet from the piano room yet. Um, right, I forgot that's a prerequisite. Okay. Right, 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 right. That's how we do that. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to take the terrace. It's... Uh, Definitely safe. And, uh, yeah. Just, uh, trying to retrace my steps for where I've been and which areas are clear. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah, but we did just save, so no worries there if I have to reload. Um, yeah, second floor. All right, keeping the inventory to a minimum because we are going to have to pick up a few items. Don't walk down a hall. Going through another door. This door's kind of fancy. It's a little fancier than the others. Um, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna grab that right now. Oh, hey, dude. I didn't realize there was anybody in here. Come on, you're not dead. I mean, you're undead, but like, you're not done. Got some crisp buns. <laughs> we got some cakes. <laughs> we got some fresh baked buns. Uh, are you actually down, dude? Are you DTF down to fight? Son of a bitch. He's down for the count. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna go through here and hope he doesn't come back like immediately. There's another guy right there. Yeah, there is. Uh, 
Ew. Shit. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's not actually down. Okay. Crap. I didn't get the pop on either of those. Uh, that sucks. Okay. Um... And I only have three, which is not great. It's okay, I think we're about to get more ammo, unless there's no ammo in here on hard mode. There was on regular mode. Oh, hey, there we go, yeah. That was in a different spot. Uh, we have to light this to actually see what we're doing. Yeah, I know there's other items in here. There was something on the shelf for Jill. I don't see any Splocklies. I know I have to go in here, and I think there's two. There's at least one zombie that spawns in. How's my head clipping behind that note? <laughs> All right. It looked kind of special, so I thought I could interact with it. Yeah, I'm just going to bait him over here. Okay, yeah, I need that. Is that all there is? Yeah, that's all there is. That's it, that's all, that's all there is. Okay. Don't think that guy's gonna find his way out of the room. So we'll be fine. Okay, we are in yellow, kind of yellowish green caution, so. Probably just gonna save these herbs for later, come back with some kerosene. But I don't want to go to the other side of the mansion right now. But I kind of have to. Anyway, for the piano room. Damn it. Like this. I think on the patio there's more kerosene. Should have figured out where the rest of the kerosenes are. Hmm. I mean, I could just go for it. Because, like... Because <clears throat> here's the thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm mostly just worried about this guy right here. Um... And I have to go to an item room anyway to get kerosene. So 
so... Because after I do this fight, I, I don't have to come back here. Like, ever, I don't think. So, yeah. I think I'm just going to get Kerosene to burn this guy. The other guy, if he does come back... Like, between now and, like, after the Yawn fight, I'm going to try to just juke him. Uh... So I'll just go to the closest item room, which would be down this way. Because there is the death mask. And maybe we still get the assault rifle? Or not rifle, um, shotgun. Combat shotgun. I think they called it an assault shotgun, though. But yeah, it holds 10 rounds instead of 6, so... Kind of better. Um, if we can get it, that'd be great. If not, whatever. Um, just gonna reorganize a little bit. And I am gonna want the shotgun, so... I need the fuel canteen. I don't need musical score, at least right now. So that should be okay. I think so. I mean, again, like. I, I saved at the end of the last episode, so even if I'm mistaken about something, um, you know, it's it's okay. Um, it's the wrong way. And actually, yeah, because zombies can go through doors sometimes. But I think if there's two doors, I don't think they can get through. Which is why I want to, like, especially Crimson Heads. Um... believe so that's why that's why I want to burn this guy because he's only one door away from like a hallway that I'm gonna go back through quite a few times the next guy not so much crap no I did this early crap I need to go I need I need the musical score man I gotta take it to the other room. Fuck, that's right. Um, so he probably is gonna come back then by the time I get back over there. It's all right. Um, I think I need to go out to that patio to refuel. I think. So I may as well do that now. Because uh, later I would rather not go back there. And there might be some new enemies on the way, but I got a full heal on me and the shotgun, which I guess I don't need yet. Got a little bit ahead of myself because I forgot about taking the music to the piano room. OK. 
Okay, so the handgun magazine, the handgun, fuel canteen, full heal, uh, and the music. I think the door is going to break after I go through it right now. But that's okay. Oh, it's already broken. Shit. Ah, <sighs> that sucks. Okay, um... And that's really not great. Oh, it's not that bad, actually. We open the shortcut through the graveyard. I'll just do that. Because I'd much rather do that, because I don't think there's any enemies between here and that point. Um, then go all the way around. Although, actually going all the way around, I think I'll only need to juke, like, two Cerberuses. I could just turn back around and if they do deal a tiny bit of damage I mean yeah they don't deal as much damage as like the zombies do so and based on where the door is like as soon as I go through like after that long hallway like the southeast one it's just right there on my right so I don't think it's a big deal This does give that other zombie more time, though, to, like, respawn into a Crimson Head, so... Not feeling about great about that, but I was kind of figuring that would happen anyway, so... But yeah, this should be the last time I need to go through here. Well, except for on the way back, but... Unless they still don't bust through the windows, that's cool. Don't want to come back this way later, so. Oh, there's still plenty. Oh, so this has two refills. Oh. Ow. Get off me. Okay. It's not bad. One tackle, like, it doesn't deal as much damage as, like, a bite. Yeah, let's see, we're still in yellow caution. Like, it is not that big of a deal. Uh, so... Gotta go to the music room, which is first floor, and... There weren't any enemies in this hallway a second ago, so hopefully the same is true, but even if the dogs do bust through the windows. Not the biggest deal in the world. Yep. Yeah, see? Then I mean, yeah. Because they bust through the glass, man, and then they have to get reoriented, you know? And the nice thing about dogs is they definitely can't use doors. No. They can break through windows, but doors, nah. Can't do it. Um, thankfully, the Spencer's sprung for solid mahogany. Uh, let's see. So we have the music thing, we have the fuel canteen... Got ammo. I don't think we even need ammo right now, but I do need that key to get through to the fight, so. And I 
believe I'm also, well... Uh, then I wouldn't have an extra... Okay, we'll do that here in a minute. I'd have to waste my healing item uh, if I grab that now. Because then we wouldn't have inventory space. Don't like the sound of that. thing was the only thing in this room which I haven't grabbed it yet but I did grab it when I was doing recon mm -hmm. okay examine light sonata yep oh you actually can open it okay section of the music is missing, leaving only the beginning and the end of the music. Okay. Okay, examine. Beginning and last sections of the music are missing. Oh, I wonder, man, let those notes do. That is like, oh, that is not easy. Combine, bam, there we go. Examine. Title, I know what the title is. Complete musical score, Moonlight Sonata, yeah. Okay, I think I have to mute this part, um, although I don't know if Chris even knows how to play piano. Uh, let's see. Just, um, expensive looking grand piano, yeah, use. Yeah, he doesn't know how to play. It's terrible, Chris. <laughs> it's me, Chris. You know, Rebecca, Rebecca the one who knows how to play that piano. Sounded like Moonlight Sonata. <laughs> no, it did not. <laughs> Can you play? Sure. Just give Danjo a second to mute the music. Because I can play perfectly. Yeah, she just plays it like it's the actual recording. <laughs> I mean, she's messing up a little bit. Okay, she's messing up a lot. In fact, I probably don't even have to mute this. Chris. Uh, yeah, I probably didn't even have to mute that, honestly. <laughs> It was better than Chris by a lot, but like it was still pretty bad. Um, of course, letter practice. So do I actually have to come back or do I just wait? I get that she's practicing. Anyway, it opens, you, you guys may remember this from the Jill part, like, Jill is apparently the best piano player in Stars. And it's, I don't know, it's, Rebecca even part of stars? I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, maybe I have to get the... Uh... Hmm. Oh my goodness, you can still hear it. All right, I might have to get the emblem thing first. 
and then come back or something. I have no idea. I mean, you can't hear it now. I'm just going to leave it muted for like a little bit. You can't hear it now, but I'm assuming as soon as I go back in this hallway. Yeah, you can hear it again. And like most of the notes are there, so I feel like I should keep this muted. All right, Rebecca, are you miraculously better now? No? <sighs> Close. Like she's getting the first part of it. Oh my god. Do I have to go like talk to Rich or something or what? What I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. Mm. Is there a serum for like magically getting better at piano? Because if so, that's that's what we need. Like for real. All right, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try going back and talking to Rich. I'm assuming he's still in the room. Yeah, screw that. I'm going to go around. Two zombies on the other side of that door. So... Hmm. Yeah, I think that's what I'm supposed to do, probably. I don't really get... Oh, right, I was going to check the kerosene can down here as well. I think I depleted it, but I'm not sure. Honestly, kind of surprised she, like... No, it's, yeah, it's depleted, yeah. I'm kind of surprised she got most of it. Like, at least, like, the beginning part on her first try. Which, maybe it's not her first try. Maybe she's just not that good at piano, and she's been trying to nail Moonlight Sonata for, like, years. Like, in which case, we would never, like, be able to get, make it out of this mansion. But... Oh... Something gonna happen or 
That's it? Really? You just sit next to him for a second? That's okay. That's all it is, huh? Okay. Um, we might need more inventory space. I'm not really sure, so I'm just gonna deposit. Ugh. And I was supposed to. I was supposed to have like space between these. At least that's how I wanted it to be. puzzle stuff, and then the ink ribbons, there we go. So... Oh wait, aren't I, I'm already hurt a little bit, right? Yeah, okay. I guess I'll take like two green herbs. Like mix them. Just take them now. And I mean, I'm assuming we could probably go back and just like do the puzzle now for which I would need the emblem probably won't need either of these so Move some of these a little bit down. There we go. Just so we have like a little bit of space in between like um, categories and shit. There we go. All right, uh, hmm, how are we doing on time? Okay, uh, we could end this a little bit early, or we could go back first. You know what, let's, let's do that. I don't, I don't want to, that's a little bit of a cliffhanger. Does Rebecca get better at the piano? Does Danjo finally get the other key that he needs to fight Yon? He said it at the top of the episode, but does that mean it's actually gonna happen? <laughs> Tune in next time for another exciting edition of Resident Evil HD. I don't know... What is that impression of? Oh, it was like the second... Not the first one, but the other Saturday Night Live announcer guy that also did like... I think he was also the announcer... Like narrator guy for The Price is Right back in the Bob Barker days. Is that the same guy? I want to say yes, but I don't know. 
I don't want to go through that hallway because there's a few zombos in there. Um, yeah, and this is a helmet door, right? Yeah. All right, I'll just go around. It's fine. Well, I really wanted to get to the on fight. Um, in this episode, it looks like we're not going to quite get there. But I mean, I can't think of what else might be the trigger for like Rebecca getting good at the piano, you know? Like, I mean, presumably Jill's around here running around doing stuff like Maybe we could just borrow her for a few minutes and be like, Hey, can you just bust out Moonlight Sonata on this expensive looking grand piano, please? Um, yeah, we have to be on the first floor. I need the emblem and some healing stone. Okay, yeah, we'll be all right. Uh, I just really prefer to be walking around with full health, you know what I mean? Plus, like, pretty soon we'll be able to get, like, a lot more healing items and shit. Uh, and if I do some of these next steps... Well... Oh, wait, do I have to inspect... This? Because I don't think I've done this on this uh, playthrough yet. Because that is relevant to what's going to be happening. Do I need to examine this? Like... Thing. Okay. All right. Um, yeah, Moonlight Snow that started up again. Yeah, don't get through the door, please. It'd be really cool in this game. Oh, there we go. Cool. Good to hear. It's it's exactly verbatim exactly how it works yeah so that's how it sounded um i think we're good now yeah please stop playing that music <laughs> i'll tell you what this is this is uh something we need and the gold emblem yeah which we need that here in a bit i meant to actually grab the other thing on the floor, the diary, which we already, we, these are the same, we already read through all these in the jail playthrough. Spent a good amount of time actually like reading all the materials quite carefully, so put the old dirty one in here. Mm -hmm. So we can actually get out of this room. That should be clear, yep. Can I not talk to? Oh, there right we go. There? Yeah. Were you all right in there? Uh huh. <laughs> Something written on the corner. No, it's not. It's going for the door. It's like it was dark and scary. But yeah, I'm okay. It sounds terrible. Do you want me to play more Moonlight Sonata for you? Uh, no, no, that's fine. I mean, you know, you don't have to go through the hassle. Hmm. 
think. Hmm. That's your destiny will open. It's like you can turn the gears. Try it. Yes, please. Turn which gear? Uh, leave, actually. Let me check the thing again. Right, the short sword through the breast. The long sword is through the head. Okay, right. Okay, so just the large gear, because it's just set to midnight right now. And the large one is the hour hand, I believe. Large. Turn it. Either left or right, doesn't really matter. Gonna have to do it twice. Yeah. Large. Oh. Yes. Large. Left. Yes. Large. Left. Short through the breast, large through the head. No. And... Yeah. Examine. Ba -bow. There's an engraving of a shield. It's the shield key. Alright, cool. Um, so this is a thing, mm. yeah, I'm likely going to have to try this a couple of times. So... I know we just saved somewhat recently, but that was like more steps than what I was... Uh, than I remembered. And... Kind of for the sake of a series, you know, this being a series and stuff. Um, I'm not sure which one of those things triggered the other thing. Mm. Eh, how many ink ribbons do we have? I mean, I'm going to get more. And I kind of know what to do, so... I don't think we're in any danger of running out of ink ribbons. I do want to keep progress kind of like moving along, you know? But since I'm kind of expecting to have to reload the save, yeah, I'm just going to save the game. Um, Cause yeah, I don't want to have to redo basically a whole episode's worth of steps, which I could have done that faster, but yeah. Um, okay, so basically we're going to be doing the on fight and he's probably going to be stronger than last time, so I'm going to bring the shotgun and the shells that I have. Just the one heal, but it's a full heal and we're at full health right now. But again, probably going to reload. But we'll see. If I can get it done with only a few rounds fired, then cool. Mm-hmm. Use an ink ribbon, definitely. And we'll save over the... Th yeah, the third one. Yeah. 
which I mean, I could have reloaded the last one and, well, the third one and then done all that stuff off screen, blah, 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 but anyway, it's, it's fine. It's fine the way it is. We still have four ink ribbons, so I'm not worried about that. Um, yeah. So next time, uh, we're gonna go on a little serpent hunt. That's uh, kind of the plan for now. Kinda a little bit of a plan. So it's kind of funny when you... It's Chris. Yeah, he doesn't quite do the same thing that Jill does. When you just like... I guess he backs up a little bit. Yeah, for Jill, I think if you just tap like left and right, yeah, he's definitely backing up. I think she moves forward. Apparently Chris does not and he, uh, Backs up a little bit. Huh. Anyway, it's another one of those weird things. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for today. So thank you all for being here, guys. Greatly appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed. Um, so yeah, next time, Snake Hunt, which is Serpent Hunt. <laughs> that sounds better. Um, but yeah, of course, before we get going, a very special thank you going out to the current Farts and Crap Show members, the amazing people who make it possible. Novellus, Dracona, Stone Sabino, and Aaron Schick, thank you all so, so much for choosing this pair, for choosing to support the show a bit more directly via channel membership. It vastly helps out. It's very much appreciated. Um, and it is the best way to support the show more directly, which eventually, if we can... Uh, you know, get more channel members. We'll be running less ads on the daily videos. So, um, and yeah, uh, occasionally for milestones, I've done ad-free series as well. Uh, last time was at 10 channel members and we did Hyper Light Drifter for that. Completely ad-free. You can watch here on the channel. Um, next one will be at 15. So, if uh, you guys want, yeah, the daily videos to be ad-free, that's how you go about doing it. And also, if you want to get in on voting on the members' choice polls, which is how all the series here on the show get decided. So, um, yeah, it's a thing we do once a month for a full seven days, so 25% of the time we do have one going. And uh, yeah, we will have one for July coming up at some point. That hasn't happened yet. It's going to be deciding the series that's going to be replacing this one. So, a new retro classic series. But, but yeah, at this point in time, not really sure when that's going to be happening. Um, and this is an approximation of future announcements from the past. So if you guys want all the announcements as they happen and the bell doesn't work out for you, it's totally fine. I get it. The bell doesn't work for me either. Uh, but there's three other ways you guys can stay up to date. So the community tab here on the channel, the Farts and Crap Show Twitter, or the Discord. I always post on all three whenever there's an announcement. So regardless of which one of those works for you, uh, you can stay up to date. And uh, tier the tiers. <laughs> The links for those are down in the description, also on the channel banner. Um, but that's going to do it for today. So thank you all once again for being here, guys. Till next time, take care, and I hope you all have a fantastic day.